Hello everyone, welcome to a new stream. Today is a great day, a big day for big time because there is a new patch, the 0 0.27 version and this one will be a huge one. I mean, the economy is still not here available but still there are a lot of new things to check and we are going to play today and try to find all the new things that they implemented and let's see if it's possible because there is a long list you can check always the patch notes there in the blog in the medium website there they are always publishing the, the the release notes there but we are going to try to to have fun we are going to starting from scratch because as you probably know there is a new wipe that means that <laughs> everything was reset not the nfts obviously the collectibles but everything else uh, pocket watches experience uh, quests everything everything was reset as usual it's a new wipe you know but once we move to the i guess it was the beta the beta phase i guess that no in the beta there will be also uh, new wipes it will be the the public version the release the final release in this moment it's when there won't be more wipes but by now we are still having them so it's a good chance a great chance to to try to check and see how we how it is because they have been improving also the tutorial you know the the first uh quests and faces at the very beginning when you're starting and you you need to select the beginner uh pocket watch and starting selecting the class and try to adapt and learn how the game works they have been improving this as well and I can tell you that now it's much better. Yeah, much better. So let's go there and start playing because I still need to choose the class and start with the starting quest. Yeah. And also uh, for this month, um, I just played three adventures. I just completed three adventures for the 8th drop of August. So that means that I still need to complete 17 adventures. So... I guess that playing this uh, tutorial, we are going to complete at least, I guess that three, four, five adventures at least. So my goal for today will be to complete seven, between seven and 10. That will be great. So let's see if we can do so. So let me post on Twitter about the stream and also on this score, because this is something that I'm always forgetting to do. And it's very important. <laughs> so let's jump into the game and start playing probably have the music from spotify a little loud so let me also volume down something like that and let's start playing by the way i today was the day for the distribution for the airdrop of uh let me think july so if you were lucky like me you already received one box so let's go to the game Yep, there we go. And we're going to Frankfurt, yeah. This is the typical server for Europe, but many people play even if they are not from Europe. So let's start here. And probably I will stop the music because something something cool that they also added in this patch, it's new background music and other uh, special effect sounds and things like that. So I will love guys that you can also listen the new music. That will be great. So I'm going to start the music once the game starts when we are choosing the class. Obviously we could try to check the patch notes, but I don't want to get this stream boring. So you can do this by your own. And this is the starting guys. So let me stop the music, pause it, and there we go. Okay, this is the layout with the, you know, the different actions that you can perform in the game. And uh, it's a typical one. Yeah, nothing changed it, I guess. <clears throat> yep. And now the class. I was asking this on Twitter because on Twitter well for me it's Twitter but now it's X I prefer Twitter <laughs> I don't know what should I choose I mean I love Shadow Blade but for the Time Warrior it's much easier at the very beginning so I'm not sure 
mm, not not going to use quantum fixer right now at the beginning because it will be a pain and the chronomancer it's a little weak so let's choose something in the middle and choose the shadow blade. oh i would love to have the tech blade at the very beginning but that's not possible so let's choose shadow blade and something guys that you can already see here in this instance from the dungeon you can see the line light effects i mean you can see how everything the light effect it's smoother than before you can see the shadows and things like that they were improving many textures many light effects and now it's so so beautiful and this is nothing honestly this is nothing compared to what you are going to see later because there are some dungeons that they are so 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 beautiful honestly so let's just start um welcome to big time cadet okay i guess that we need to move forward so first of all let's go to the collectible section um because guys i was buying <laughs> i bought some collectibles in the marketplace the other day and let me see yeah there we go i bought uh because i didn't have any kind of food step decal and particles so i wanted to buy this void effects because i thought that for the shallow blade and tech blade will be so cool will be so cool to have this void effects i'm going to show you now and also some emotes the meditation and the drink coffee so yeah i have these ones and let me let me set something else there we go typical armor set for the shadow blade and for the hands I have the uncommon one because i don't have the the rare someday i will get it or maybe buy it but not yet by now i need to use the uncommon one so also the skills let's see oh yeah let's review quickly something something very cool that they implemented in this version it's that different sections that you have you have the main well in your back you have the main section this one for the typical uh potions uh, and equipment but then you have another section the materials ones that you can mine the different rocks and stones and things like that and you will have the ores here so then also the typical one the abilities and then also another cool section it's the pocket watches section here at the left side you can see that now we will have uh well we have two slots only by now because we are at level one of the pocket watch the current one but in the future we will be able to expand these slots i will show you now but right now we can yeah we can collect two more pocket watches and we can switch between them I have no idea if we collect more pocket watches if for example you collect more than two the third one will jump here into this back or you won't be able to collect it this is a good question i guess that it's like a, an auxiliary yeah it's an auxiliary slots that you can collect some pocket watches to don uh annoy you here and make some noise and then later if you need more slots maybe you can also collect and store them here in your main bag but anyway also you will be able to expand this auxiliary timeline well auxiliary slots for the pocket watches and for the materials here in this passive tree passive tree yeah with these skills let me check which ones uh slot increase yeah oh this is the pocket watch slot chris perfect this is the one for the left side pocket watches and inventory space i guess this is the regular one and this is for the materials yeah crafting material slots so cool that's all oh i i forgot the <laughs> to assign my skill points let's use this one yeah let's go and also the stats some dexterity and anything passive maybe yeah one passive point um Okay, I prefer this one for the minimap. Ah, I'm talking about the minimap. Now there is also a huge big map. You can see. Oh, wait. Come bot. Now, for example, you can see the typical minimap at the top right corner. But if you press M, you can see now a bigger map here at the right side 
just below. So that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. And let's do the first quest because it's pretty, very, very easy. Let's jump. Let's see what else we need to do. Okay. Double tap. There we go. Pretty easy, this. And now we need to exit the cave. So let's go there. Ah, and I forgot to use my collectible for the dual swords. I'm going to do this right now. Right now. <laughs> Let's go there, full collection. And let me use this one because it's pretty cool. Everything red for the Shadow Blade. And let's go there. Yeah, the, the one, the skin that I'm using the collectible for the dual swords, it's about uh, a special skin that was available only for the, for the gold pass season. So uh, let me inspect the cat's color. This is the same, pet the cat. There we go. And now we can enter the frost caverns. Cool. Let's go there. As I said, this, this will be great in order to get more adventures completed for the eardrop of August. Very, very cool. Let me see if the audio is fine. Oh, yeah. Cool. Also, let me see if the settings for the audio are good enough. Oh, Master 8. Let me see, 25, it, that's good enough. Okay. Here we have the first bug. I'm naked without collectibles. <laughs> Something cool that I want to do, guys, while I'm playing, it's always reporting these bugs that we find in the stream. So, let's go. There we go. And let's try to uh, activate the heavy attack. Boom. There we go. Oh. And use the and for heavy attack finisher. Let's do it at the same place. Like they are suggesting. Cool. <clears throat> Tap the key above the footbar. Okay, uh, let's do for example two. By the way, this skill can be removed from the uh, well, hotkey bar because you can use the rest skill with the Z. That's something important that I always forget, and I, well, that's an extra slot that you can get for a, another skill or potion or whatever you want. Open your inventory tab. Oh, and now mm, the collectible for my helmet. Oh, what? Okay, so my helmet disappeared. That's interesting. That's interesting. I guess that the team is aware about this, but anyway. Uh, open your tab and drag a potion. Okay, let's do this. Uh, wait. Okay. Um, something weird happened here. Okay, let's see if we can... For some reason... And I'm not able to exit the... Oh, the dungeon, right? No, because it's there, maybe? No, not there. Okay, so the problem that we have now is that some items uh, are invisible here in the in the main bag. And I'm... Well, also the pocket white disappear. And I'm not able to continue with the tutorial. So that's the problem. Maybe because I was using collect tables. Mm, not sure if that's the reason, but it'd be. Anyway, let's play. And maybe exiting the, the game later and entering a game, we can fix this. 
Now let's use... Ooh. There we go. Yeah, it was like he was summoning some some enemies. Interesting. So, um... <clears throat> well, maybe... I don't know if I do this... Ah... Uh, they thought that I could cheat the, the system. Well, let's see if we can find a potion and maybe it will appear in the inventory and we can finish this. There we go. Another one. It's there. So let's go this way. Let's play some music because now we don't have music here in the game. So it's a little boring. There we go. Much better. And here we need to kill some specific enemies. Oops. I know we also run that. Boom. Oh! Oh, but then warrior. Oh my goodness. It was... Ah, cool. We loot something. So, that was... Oh my goodness. You can also complete some quests from the tutorial. Even they are not yet available. So, this is probably a future quest that we already completed. Not sure if this is intended or not. So, I'm going to report this. Just in case. Um... Still missing two targets, so let's go there. Here, remember, guys, we need to collect something special. Ooh! They improved this animation. So cool. Huh. I didn't expect this. You can see, like, I'm oh, running and it's spinning there in the air. So cool. This is a secret item that you can find here in this part of the cave. And this is going to give us some extra rewards like potions and some experience and gold. So very, very recommended to get this item, guys. Wow, this is a time. It's so, so cool. Boom. Let's go there last target and after doing this we are going to go to the boss room let's do the special attack boom and level up let's see if we can collect warrior nothing let's open the chest remember every time that you finish the quest there is a chest reward oh some legs for later Let's see. Oh, yeah. Look like this bag is affecting all new items. So I will need to to exit later the the game after this dungeon and see if we are able to fix it. Let's go there. Ah, oh, so cool this animation. So cool. Okay. And done let's collect a little of experience even if we are okay let's assign the points first oh the pocket these skills also disappear oh my goodness okay 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 okay, okay. let me oh. i'm going to Ah, oh, one enemy just escaped. Yeah. Ah, so beautiful these animations. Seriously, I love it. I love it. When you're running and it's starting to spin, I love it. So let me just add a timestamp to my... Yeah, there we go. So I can report this easily later to the team. And let's continue. Let's continue. Heat to the boss chamber. Yep. You know that these dungeons from the tutorial, all of them, because we will play some more later, they are very, very easy to finish because there is only one quest. The, well, you will see that the rest of adventure, uh, your journey, I mean, all dungeons have two quests 
but the ones from the tutorial they only have one quest and the boss room it's very easy one wow <laughs> one tongue bug and six minor bugs so let's see what happens because the only skill that i have it's the uh, sweep the leg that's the only one okay the tongue bug is still not coming and uh, let's see i'm collecting this for later and now there is only one more little bug small coughing mantis and the tongue bug is coming okay oh. so, evade great let's go there sweep the leg it, there we go boom <laughs> and done so let's collect the rewards by doing this we are completing one adventure for the eighth drop of this month remember you need to open the test that's very important and collect this this is for the quantum fixer shadow blade great and time warrior and small speed potion great so i'm not going to collect it even for selling later nah not worth my time okay so let's see if one we we exit oh shit i was going to this yeah anyway okay here we have this yeah the recap we call ah the artifact fragment yeah of course artifact fragment great and some equipment and two potions so let's exit the dungeon by using this portal and let's see guys if now the ui is fix or not okay good thing it's that the collectibles appear here that's nice nice to see and the items are there okay so looks like the bug was happening only inside that dungeon i don't know what is the reason but i will report this obviously i mean the more information the team has the better so um as you could see there in the let's say the tooltip there this this message we need to drag one potion to the hotkey bar so let's drag this number nine and another one eight and the trees of life let's do this in just just in case here and we have no we can remove the rest skill because you can do it with the Z key from your keyboard. And let's see, because we have one skill point. Oh, the bug is stopped. Let's do this. And let me see the item that I wasn't able to use. This is because I need more dexterity. Okay, I want this. I don't want this. I need this. And this for the time warrior. Mmm i'm going to save it for later just in case i want to to use the time warrior pocket whites just in case so i'm going to add the power bed that should be fine and let's add more dexterity oh and i have more pending okay and another skill point really okay let's use the, yeah, the invisibility and passive tree uh, I'm not able to get this because I need character rank 15. Okay, not yet. So let's use this. And I guess that's all now. Okay, the next one could be the pocket white slot. So this is for the inventory space. This means here, this main back. So we, yeah, increase one slot. Cool. So let's see if we have more skills. And oh wait, I want to change this. Much better. Yeah, much better. And now we need to talk with waffles. And remember the item that we were collecting, the secret secret item, we can deliver now. And give waffles the catnip. That was the purple shining thing that we found in the cave. So we deliver it and we are going to get extra potions. This is the stone portal to, to go to Water Town quickly. And, well, all potions. Oh, we didn't receive the, the, the tone portal. Anyway, um, present the token of bravery. That's the one that we've collected now. 
this is not even a token an nft nothing like that it's just a simple uh let's say badge that we collected in the dungeon so as you can see let's place this here and this here by now and yeah no town portals so let's use this portal to go down Ooh, some junk items and we need to tow yeah i don't remember the name Ed edward let's see let's see because i, I forgot the name erwin is running there let's start with him okay he's going to give us one back i guess back a here okay your new back grants you additional let's go yeah it's a small back only four slots but that's good enough and now we can go to this droid yeah it's droid and collect whatever he needs to give us i'm here for edwin's package let's go There we go. And now we have warding potions, a small energy and a small health potion. So keep your new weapon. So yeah, it's better than the one that we have. Great. And now this one is tier two. Oh, interesting. So, okay. I don't know if I'm going to use this, honestly, but let's keep it. And uh, yeah, more portal, right so let's sell some stuff here to this bandry because i remember that he had the very good prices so let's sell this oh really good prices so yeah maybe it's a wow should i sell this yeah it's only movement speed energy and health so let's sell it and same thing for yes, yes. because this green droid you will see guys that has the better prices to sell things so will be a great idea to collect as many things as you can and sell to this bandroid just before you leave this area because at some point we will need to leave and you will never be available to sell stuff to this bandroid again and i never found so good prices like this guy has so let's go to this dungeon this is just a small small tip for you guys because i the last time that i was playing this i was collecting a lot of gold in this area i was able to collect like 50k i knew i was only level seven or eight something like that it was so crazy so if you want to collect quick easy gold you need to do it here so let's do this dungeon H less bang. So let's go there. Investigate the anomaly. Typical corrupted portal. Very easy. And I guess that this dungeon is going to show us the new assets that they, they were using. For the scenario, I mean. Oh, I want to use the shurikens already because they are really really useful and these helmets are not well let's try to collect everything as i said let's try to do this and sell to the green android by the way you can see the footsteps that i was that i bought and now i'm using you can see these cool effects at the the ground well i'm walking and also the particles for some reason the particles don't work should be let's see if i keep it again now it should be there and someone is attacking me let's see now for some reason it doesn't work okay i'm going to report this so let's go there to the corrupt portal Killing everything that we find in our path. 
Oops. Keep nothing. There we go. And continue. Yeah, I was improving the passive skill to reveal the minimap easily. I mean, now the area that I'm revealing is bigger. That's pretty useful, you will see. Probably, probably will be the first passive skill that I will always bring. But for the next level I need to be level 15. So we need to wait a little more. And level up! Oh, 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 oh! Okay, before we start the quest, let's break some charts for extra potions. And speed potion, speed potion, tree of life, and what is this? Okay, cool. I mean, at these levels, we need to collect everything. Oh, those jars. And... Okay, let me assign the skill points. What could I do? Hmm... Just in case, let's do that. Oh! No. These stat points. Cool. Let me see also this passive skill. No, not yet. So, uh, I'm not able to use this yet. Five more stat points. Not yet. Hey, darlinking. Hey, which is the name of your hip weapon NFT? Let me show you. This is from the Gold Pass season. By the way, darlinking, <laughs> welcome, man. I know that you are a deaf from big time. Um, let me show you. Oh, this one. Battle Blade of Sir Branor. This is from the Gold Pass season. They, well, it was one of the exclusive NFTs there. By the way, I found some issues that I'm going to report later. If it's not today, it will be tomorrow, but I'm going to report it. But yeah, some weird things happened before while I was playing the tutorial, by the way. But yeah, thanks. Uh, I'm looking at that issue of missing inventory. Oh, great. Yeah, I don't know if you were before when it started, but it happened in the whole dungeon the the first one i mean when waffles uh, open opens the portal and you start you enter there uh yeah it happened there by the way i don't know if you speak spanish because i think so but i'm not sure but anyway uh yeah uh that was the issue basically so everything disappeared also here if you can see for some reason the decal of the for the steps it's not there. Yes, I'm... Vale. <laughs> ok, pues mucho mejor. <laughs> sí, digo que aquí el... El footsteps, el, creo que es el decal. Let me... Eh, decal. Eh, no aparece, no sé por qué, pero no aparece aquí. Las partículas sí, pero el decal no. Entonces no sé muy bien qué puede ser, pero lo he, lo he quitado, lo he vuelto a poner, por si acaso. Pero no me sale, así que tal vez eso sea interesante también, lo reportaré. De nada. No sé, esta es la, los NFTs que tengo ahora activos, por si te sirve de algo. No sé si hay alguna relación con el hecho de tener en las piernas, las partículas. Esto lo probé, bueno, no se puede decirlo, pero lo probé en este gym. Y todo iba bien. Así que... Y también en el live, la versión live de la 0.26 también todo funcionaba correctamente. Es curioso, no sé por qué. Lo probaré luego fuera de la tangent, probaré a ver si también falla o no. So, I was speaking in Spanish because Dark Linking also speaks Spanish, so he's from Argentina. He said in the chat. So let's continue. First of all, kill this little bug here. And now that we were assigning the... Oh, let's break this Charles here. And and yeah, start the quest. So let's do this. And now a tank bug probably will be spawn and small bugs, small bugs, and oh no tank bug this time. Okay, easier then. I know that when there is a corrupted portal, most of the time there is always a mega clocky, a tank bug, things like that. 
but this time was easier okay probably because it's a tutorial <laughs> i don't know but that was interesting and boom we completed it. we got one artifact fragment and now let's open the chest and go to the boss room so i'm collecting everything to sell it later more legs for the shadow blade but i don't have the stats right no okay let's see what else can we use this for later um the warrior so oh, let's do this the warrior quantum okay let's mark everything with the trash icon because then later with the bandroid if you press i guess it's a j key you can sell everything easily so let's go there no need to recover oh we have one bandroid but you will see the prices okay let's check this first but now as you can see the prices okay let's remember 98 98 for example and let's see the green bandroid the prices for this one because I have the feeling, honestly, that it's much better than that band. So let's sell later. And let's keep moving. Okay, so here we are. The typical huge yellow door for the boss room well you know that in the previous patch we already saw that not it's not always a, uh, the typical yellow door sometimes it's an area where you start and many bugs start spawning around you and this is a very cool addition that they did really love it because in the, pre in the past it was always the same the green yellow door i think the big yellow door but now it's very very different so uh we have only one tank bug to kill only one Ooh. okay they are level three i am level four okay uh, let's sweep the leg let's sweep the leg boom and back stop back stop back stop oh come on oh it's dancing it's dancing <laughs> It's dancing. Boom! Backstab. <laughs> Great. So now we can collect the rewards. So we finish another adventure. And wow! That's new. I never collected the chest reward here at the at the bottom. It was always at the other side of the dungeon when the well, where the portal also spawns. But here it's this is something new and oh a chest a, well this is one artifact fragment great and another one i guess because we completed the quest not sure let's collect the chest piece and what else another shoulders potion and chest piece chest. okay we got many things to sell later and now the recap let's see and we collected two artifact fragments. No, yeah, two. Great, so now we have three, I guess. Let's see this. Yeah, three. So let's equip. Perfect. Oh, we are not able to sell this, I guess. So let's drop it. And what about this? Eh, it's better. So, yeah. Okay, let's sell it. And same thing for this. We want this for later because it's a little better and sell this okay so let's exit yeah this is completely new yeah the portal i never saw the portal spawning here in the middle of the lake that's cool and we complete two more adventures guys so i'm going to update the title because i forgot to do it before so now oh that was so fast okay so now i have completed five of 20 adventures for this a drop we are only one day left so i'm trying to do my best to complete the 20 adventures and now let's visit oh 
Again, I don't have uh, collectibles here. I'm naked. <laughs> this is a noun issue, guys, so don't worry about this. The team is working on this. So let's talk with this Bentroid. And as I told you, instead of only 89, no, 89, no, 98 gold, now it's 257, more than the double. So, um, yeah, I can sell everything. I'm 2000 gold, so now selling everything, boom, 3400. Great. It's all about money. <laughs> At least now at the beginning. Later, you maybe... I don't know if crafting is going to cost money, but by now, it's more than enough. So, let's stall with Schrodinger. Hand over the artifact. Yes, I have seen it. Okay, continue, continue. Okay, two fragments in total. And... Okay, we got something. Oh, the gear. So, probably will be a very basic one. And maybe adding some stats, I guess. Oh, and we level up. Level 5. Great, so uh, first of all, let's check this. And yeah, we are getting some max health extra. Yeah, so let's place it here with the pocket watch. And go to the skill tree. So I'm going to... Yeah, I'm... Mm. Ninja leap. Okay, I'm going to... No. Okay, let's save this for later. Um, doing this and still nothing, right? No. What do we need? Rank 15? And what about this? Unlock via request progression. Oh, this will be later. Okay, interesting. So, let's continue. Oh, look at this. Look at this. We can sell this. Because Bactoria doesn't want all of this, and we can just sell it to the Bentroid. Thanks, Bactoria. Oh, let's go keep collecting because he doesn't want or she doesn't want to sell it. That's curious. I mean, anyway, let's first of all review this chest piece. Let's see. Now nah, it's it's not good. So. Uh, well, everything is quantum fixer. Oh, shadow blade. Oh, no, 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 no. I want this for later. Yeah. And the quantum fixer. And the warrior. So let's sell all of this. Sell. There we go. And now. Oh, now we need to go get the portal fragment from Arid Desert. Let's go there. And this way. This way, this way, yeah. Yeah, now the tutorial, I can tell you, it's much better. Uh, at least as far as I remember when we were playing this. So, they really made some great improvements. So, now we are playing... Um, Another portal, this is the second portal, well, the third one, because the first one was with waffles. This is the second one, 4 7, great. And as I was thinking, uh, playing with the Shadow Blade, it's, it's more than enough, I mean. I thought that maybe I will be suffering a little uh, being killed easily or trying to be so so careful when fighting but hey not too complicated at this point so feel free to choose Time Warrior, Shadow Blade, whatever you prefer and let's start this let's go let's rest a little Z Z key to rest and local flora so this is about collecting the flowers only. And now the difference from the very beginning, if you were playing one year ago, or well, one year and a half ago, it was so easy to collect flowers in the past, just pressing E and you collect it instantly. But now, oh, this asset is new, I guess. I mean, this here in the middle, 
it's not only sand there are some rocks i don't remember this it's pretty cool um here we have some raptors no one raptor and two fox as i was saying something that they changed with the flowers quest is that you need to stay there and cast the collecting the collecting feature the collecting action i mean it's not instantly done now not gonna not gonna lie to you guys i prefer when it was instantly done but hey it's it's a <laughs> a bigger challenge now so um because before in the past you were running and just collecting it was pretty pretty easy <laughs> but anyway now you need to be careful to clean everything because if there are enemies around you are not able to collect it like chess if there are enemies around chess you're not able to open it whoops and boom okay ah, we have one chest there harvest resources uh Oh, yeah, they changed also the stones. You remember maybe in the past, in the previous part, it was a huge uh, block of stone, rock. But now it's these little ones. So you need to be careful because maybe you can miss them if this is the... Oops, let me change the weapons. Which one is better? Uh, maybe you can miss them if you don't recognize them quickly. So now you can see that there are some uh, special lightning effects there, some particles shining so that's something that also happens with the nfts so pretty cool mm, it's the same time that you need to spend i guess so let's collect these ores and check what we were checking before the material section and you can see there the copper ores that's cool let's open the chest and see if we can find something interesting and quantum fixer no and i'm getting so many pieces of quantum fixer come on um okay let's clean everything to get as much experience as we can and i saw another different kind of rock to mine hey this confetti why mm, that confetti shouldn't appear there okay i will report it and again so beautiful look at this art style it's a stylized art uh, i'm so i'm so so passionate about pixel art and also a uh, stylized art and you can see so beautiful look at this so so beautiful wow so let's collect it yeah i'm when i see new assets like this i'm I'm just checking assets for a while because I just love them. So, we collected very special ores, by the way. Well, it was not an ore, it was a ruby, I guess. Ruby and silver ore. Cool. So, it looks like now the different uh, types of rocks where you are going to mine different minerals or ores, looks like they are different from each other. I, I'm not sure about this because we saw only two different rocks but looks like that quantum fixing and shadow blade legs and finally new legs i mean they are just common legs probably tier one but good enough let's keep playing and collecting some flowers and done and done what about this? Hmm, nah. Not yet, because I'm not using any skill yet. I mean... Hey! Now it's instantly done again. Let me see. If I do this... Oh, they changed this again. <laughs> okay, great. And you can collect it even if there are enemies around. Wow, I love it. Seriously, this was something that... It was a little annoying when you needed to collect it for... Well, harvest the flowers but now it's oh okay that was a great great change a great improvement a great roll up roll back i mean <laughs> okay cool so let's open this chest and a lot of things but 
Hello Blinks. Oh, that's interesting. That's interesting because I have my uh, helmet NFT. Oh, wait. I have my helmet NFT. Oh, wait, what is this? Okay, this is so weird. I have... Wow, now my mind is blowing. Okay, I don't know if you are here, darling, but you can check this. I'm using one NFT and at the same time one digital equipment. I don't know, digital helmet. I don't know how to say this, but an in-game item. And it's a very, very curious thing to see. Double protection, I would say. Double protection. Let me let me take a screenshot of this. Double protection. It's a definitive definitive defense in this game. Okay, screenshot taken. Uh, let's keep killing. And now, oh, the boss room. So let's see if we can kill something else before we enter. Going through this way. You can see there are more flowers around, but yeah, there were a lot of flowers here. So only two more enemies to kill. Let's go there. Cool. And yeah, we are also upgrading. Oh, hey! Wow, now these special attacks when you are running, they are so devastating. Seriously. And let's go to the boss room. And we need to kill one enemy. Probably more will... Well, the counter will be updated now, I guess. Once we get closer... Oh, look at this. Uh, Dogen is fine. Let's do this. Cool. And... A bathing is fine. Yeah. Something cool that it was already available in the last patch is that you can stack more than one buff. It's pretty cool. And I have a feeling that will be a elemental monitor, maybe? Because I can hear some weird noises. I'm a little scared. Ah, no, it's just a town. Okay. It was just in my own imagination. Okay, we need to kill the town. We sweep the leg. Oh. Wait. Oh, let's use the back stab if I can. Okay, something that I can do. Oh wait. I can use the invisibility to Hey wait. Let's go invisible. And now I need to be careful. Oh they are killing the fauna. They are so so mean. And there we go! Let's try to... Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. I'm in trouble. So let's use the rejuvenation potion. Hey. Let's kill it. And boom. Done. So uh, let's see. Where is the chest reward? Okay, just there. And let's open the chest, and this will be a new adventure. Yeah. I have to say that if you still didn't finish all the 20 adventures for the airdrop, like me, this new patch with the wipe, it's the best thing that can happen to you. <laughs> Honestly. Okay, so, completed. Let's collect everything. New helmet, potion, and go. So we need to wait 30 seconds. And this is... Yeah, I prefer health right now. The warrior. No. Quantum fixer. Let's sell more stuff. And get rich. Uh, what else? Colonel. Quantum. Time. Quantum. Quantum. Done! And let's see, the portal should be... Yeah, should spawn here, I guess. 
Put the cap. We got only no fragments. No artifact fragments this time. Let's go. Um, probably we will need to talk with the Schrodinger again. But before doing this... Yeah. Let's try to sell the stuff to the... Well, let's use... Yeah, one speed potion to go faster. And the effect already disappeared. So let's. Um, we need to also use the skill point and stat points. Okay. And. Throwing is here, bad. First of all, let's go there. But, um, let's press G. J, I mean. And boom! Wow, nice. six thousand, six thousand! <laughs> oh, what's happening here? Oh, someone was breaking the dust. And okay, let's go. This is Chang. Yeah, Chang. It's not worth to to collect it because you cannot sell it. And well done, young Shadowblade. Personal metaverse luck. Cool. So, um, mm, 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 mm. and also the skill point. Found a personal metaverse portal. Okay, I'm going to do this, but first of all, oh. okay, um, let's do this. Cool. And also, um, yeah, the stat points. We need more, one more stat point to use the legs, by the way. And I want the ninja leap, but let's use, what could we use? Let's use this. I mean, probably I will use a new pocket watch later, because it, this is a very, very basic one. So, um, personal metaverse number four, and we can spawn it here. And enter the... Oh, okay. Cool, because uh, I have... Yeah, I was fixing... Well, not fixing, but moving away my NFTs from my in-game account. Because I had so many decoration NFTs that I wasn't able to select even the spaces. But now I can finally do it. Oops. Uh, speak with the gem crafter. Okay, that's part of the quest. Cool. What can I get for you? and oh we got some materials so probably we will be able to craft our first gem that's cool because i never did it i mean as part of the tutorial so let's do this and yeah indeed we can craft this the fire gem oh we can also craft returns a percentage of damage done i want this yeah i want this what else can we craft well depending what what is saying the craft and slot a gem okay can be any of them so yeah i w hmm life stealer yeah i want this just in case craft and Have there we go journey. and now we need to place the gem here so let's do this 1000 gold and done so let's see if we can place something here inside maybe yeah i should be able to sell something well maybe later anyway let's place all these spaces guys because that's something that in the patch number uh well dot 26 uh, I didn't place any space here because I had this issue with the NFTs. I had so many, as I said. But now let me do this. And we'll try to remember how I was uh, designing my previous personal metaverse. So let me see. No. Yeah. There we go. This is the long one with the columns. Pretty cool. Here, I remember I had the exalted one. There we go. It's like oh, the beautiful one with this special floor and also the rooftop with some 
beautiful windows so here i don't remember what did i connect the last time mm -hmm. yeah let me connect maybe the epic well yeah the epic has columns that's cool yeah you know that many people hated the columns but also all the people like me we love the columns it's a very special one so let me clear yeah connect maybe let's mm. now nah, let's connect the legendary first because we it doesn't have any column and here let's see if we can collect connect the the epic one maybe because when it's not possible to connect oh no wait I remember it was the epic the one that was connected here so let's remove it and now connect the epic one yeah i didn't want to connect two spaces with columns together but it's fine and here we can connect the legendary and i'm thinking to connect oh look at this the window it's so realistic i mean you can see the window has nothing now you can see here there is a simulated uh, exterior but now if i remove this boom it's there again hmm that's interesting i mean it makes sense because you are placing something there and it's not anymore the window but maybe it could be updated with something else i, I don't know maybe instead of a window could be some kind of decoration or something different this will be not a bug, an improvement. So let me take a timestamp here in my stream and let's place the timestamp and connect this. And now the window it's turned turn off. So you can see also the windows has some decals there. Yeah, so so curious. So yeah, will be cool to see something different. But anyway, it's not really a bug could be a feature <laughs> so let's place here a mythic space Ooh. oh okay i don't know if this uh, was reported before probably yes but here in the preview of the mythic it's like this and once we connect the space the floor is different similar to the exalted one so this is something that i will check first if no one else reported this before and if that's the case and no one did uh, i don't think so but if no one did it i will report it so and now this is what i told you and uh, because for some reason it's not possible to to place this uh, there is a, like a tunnel or tunnel i don't know how to say this but yeah tunnel corridor I don't, I don't know how to say in english but yeah so let's connect this here okay and this is possible yeah mm -hmm. and this tunnel here hmm curious wow if i need to connect all my spaces when it will will be so crazy so let, i don't have any decorations right let me see okay yeah i have some of them it was let me see um let me place here just no in the exalted one the table just in the middle oops place item and just in the middle of the exalted one Okay, how can it rotate? No. Remember how to rotate. Anyway. Boom! So beautiful here, just in the middle. So beautiful. And what else? Uh, some beds I have and some chairs. Okay, the chairs could, could be just there. And the other one 
it's a different style don't remember if both of them they are uncommon or what but yeah and something like that boom and now this exalted space looks so special so let's go and place some beds where there are no columns like this for example let's place this one here do, 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 do. something like this cool let's search for other rooms like this one let's place another bed Arturian bed do, 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 do. okay there we go oh and I'm stuck in the bed oh okay okay now I just needed to to dash and that was enough so let's place oops nope I don't know what I did but there we go let's place this here and the other room just here let's place the last bed and by doing the oh i saw the lock there this is a very simple simple oh i'm going to get stuck again i have the feeling so let's see oh okay cool and that's all i don't ha i don't have more decorations here in my in-game account so that was all and now let's return to s rodinger so let's go there and continue the adventure so um i updated ah i didn't update the the title of the stream yet so let me update it six of 20 adventures done and by the way oh yeah the stream is okay it was shared there in the streams channel of metabrise cool so let's start with is rodinger and we need to enter a new dungeon so let's go there and frozen caves oh this is the one okay i remember which one is this yeah and there we could find some uh some some huge enemies but oh, i just forgot by a second mega clockies and things like that oh wait where is the caves oh just there mega clockies it's a typical one also tambox could be as well t-rex well indeed everything can appear inside frozen caves so let's see what are going to fight with Um, frozen caves the first quest well the first the first and only quest is about arctic robbery okay we need to break the crystals and collect the chunks crystal chunks so level five are the enemies okay Ooh. wow Let's go. Do, 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 do. Mm -hmm. So we need to break three crystals, right? Oh, there are no quantity there. It was usually three crystals, but this time it's only uh, we are bleeding. Oh, they also change. Oh, the enemy is killing the fauna, <laughs> and they are so aggressive. Also, they changed the asset for the crystal it's a new one a new asset let's go boom and let's collect this okay this asset is the same one okay so let's be careful with this enemy boom 
and let's go and break the second the second and the last one it is in the past it was three crystals well it was a typical thing three founders and collect the toxic particle or toxic whatever it was and three crystals as well but this time it's only two i guess unless we are missing something and maybe we need to get closer but if that's not the case maybe it's only two so let's go down and let's see if that's right maybe it's also because it's a quest from the tutorial and maybe they are only uh collect the rare mineral okay oh, oh, oh. and we did it so yeah it was only two again i don't know if this is part of the tutorial maybe because it's a quest of the tutorial and we only need to collect two but maybe they change it for well this quest how it works that will be cool because sometimes it was a little exhausting to collect so many oh so many crystals and toxic particles and things like that so yeah it's if it's only two i mean now it's because there is only one quest and you could think that it's so short and it's so easy to complete but when you need to complete two quests and the boss room and also oh something happened there okay i'm going to check this later in the video but as a when you need to complete two quests in the boss room believe me that and you also need to walk in very long dungeons if it's two or three it's a huge difference to complete the, the dungeon there then, I mean. so it's a great great improvement i guess but obviously the team is always making updates and upgrading and trying to improve things and they are always taking the feedback from all players so that's why it's very important to report everything back possible improvements and things like well can help the team to to improve and get this game a big one so let's start the boss room and we need to kill some yeah only the okay there were yeah there were five targets but for some reason it was it decreased to only one and it was only the the tambo okay let's use the sweep the leg i oh, know sweep the leg there we go and back stop oh come on oh come on come on come on okay let's disappear oh come on there we go and yeah, i'm not going to die i guess oh let's kill this small one at the same time and we complete the dungeon let's collect this to sell it later and open the chest and we need to assign the skill points so let's collect everything up uh, not interesting quantum mm. let's see quantum fixer chrono well, okay let's while we are waiting let's take the stuff and yeah i prefer health what about this no no chrono chrono okay it's a little exhausting now to select the, the trice icon obviously you don't need to do so you can simply when you are in the vendor it, do it with right click but i prefer to do this for later and the overall the recap so we collected no artifact fragments this time so first of all um the stat points and the skill points i'm not going to assign this time and let's go to inventory and the main and now we can finally use this so let's sign this um okay no much better yeah let's select this um now 
And finally, we can drop this. And boom, we are ready to go. So, let's exit the dungeon. Sell to the Vendroid and talk with Schrodinger again. Hmm. And I'm going to update the title of the stream because I'm always forgetting. So, 7 of 20. Okay, I told you guys. Thanks to the wipe, I never thought that I will say so. But thanks to the wipe, we can increase the number of adventures completed quickly. Wow. So let's go and use speed potion. Speed potion. And sell to the Bandroid and talk with Schrodinger. So if Schrodinger is there, probably the Bandroid will be at this side. So something that I don't like too much is that the speed uh, potion effect, it's so, so short. I mean, it doesn't last too long. But probably uh, if I use a, a higher level potion, speed potion I mean, probably the effect will be better. I don't know if... Because it's level 1 of potions, so yeah, there are better, more levels. So probably that's the reason. So ah, that's fine. So let's sell the stuff. Obviously all the potions that I have, they are only level 1. So once we get better tiers for the potions, the effects will be much better. So, by the way, you can see here. Oh, let me see. More potions should I buy now. I'm not going to buy any potion because I should have enough by now. So let's start with this Rodinger. And oh, we are close to 10k gold. That's nice. Okay, let's deliver the fragment. And now we need to go to another portal. No. To the class trainer we need to talk with so let's ah we're going to unlock that path so let's do this and skill path unlock so if we go there oh nice so we can use the ninja leaf ah nice so um let's do this and what about the passive skills mm -mm. nothing yet so what about this? Yeah, this was with the quest progression. Level 10, 15. Yeah, so nah, later. We can do this later. So let's start with this Brodinger again. And the Ninja Leap. Wait for it. Wait for it. I believe it is. So um, let's drop this. Oof, let's place this here and the ninja leap. Oh, I'm going to use the ninja leap all the time. So, uh, could be. Uh, let's change this. No, number six better. Yeah, because I'm using a razor mouse and I have these side buttons. So I. Yeah. I'm very used to use the mouse in this way. So now we need to enter a new portal and complete one more adventure. But the good thing is it's so close to us. So let's go there. Well, I think so, right? Should be there. Yeah. Oh man, what did I do? <laughs> Ow! Oh shit. So silly. <laughs> Okay, it was so easy, like... Okay. I was walking around. Great. So let's enter... Ah, wait, 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 wait. This is the puzzle. So that's cool. Something nice is that if for any reason you fall, you will spawn again uh, before you were jumping. So don't be afraid... Oh, man. Don't be afraid on... Uh... Oh, missing some jumps like this <laughs> oh okay there are some checkpoints by the way so uh, now i was respawning at the very beginning but don't worry because uh there are bit oh, let's repeat it again oh and the faunas can also troll you so be careful 
because there is a well the void dungeon where you can see faunas trolling you okay cool double jump this was one checkpoint so we can continue let's go do, 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 do. go this way and now ah uh, 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 uh. oh no oh man it was so beautiful at the first try it was like this no no it's because after falling from a let's say high distance something like that you stop running so uh once again so okay mental note stop walking okay here stop run again and jump boom and we are getting close to the end okay another checkpoint boom 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 ah, can i jump from here ah nice there's a little hack okay here it's better if you ah he was pushing me away <laughs> okay let's jump from here and another one from here cool and time's end this is the void dungeon you will see this one is so beautiful and so cool you can see the floor it's uh, appearing and disappearing it's so crazy this one time's end so let's start and here also at the end boss room it's a bathing shrine let's go okay we can go faster here the the boss room it's with a element elemental monitor ancient monitor the elemental monitor it's not appearing yet but ancient monitor it's a little easier well a little more yeah it's easier okay be careful here because i don't trust my judgment on this wow okay nice and can we go through this way no and what about the okay the enemy just came to find us and boom can we go through this way at yeah, the first time that we saw this dungeon i don't remember exactly when it was maybe it was one year ago i'm not sure honestly but it was like i don't know the, the feeling playing this was was so special because we never saw something like this and hey that's a great idea okay so um yeah, at some point you need to slow down because it's a little confusing let's see okay i'm going too fast oh three chests and one of them it has an orange light uh, i hope it has something cool ah i have the ninja leaf by the way uh, okay you can see the enemy it was in the chest and now he's coming to this way so okay we can see that we need to get there question will be how hey, 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 hey this is the way this is the way oh by the way there are new chapters or oh, new chapters new oh what happened oh some enemies spawned yeah i don't know guys if you are watching the tv show ahsoka from disney plus but there is a new episode so it's an episode number three so i still have this one pending i have no time yet so new globs and let me check this oh they are better okay cool and also let me quantum fixer quantum fixer time warrior Promancer. so uh we have no more tests that we can still go through this way
and probably there is a bridge oh another ramp okay okay a long ramp ah, okay look at this ahaha nice so here careful with the platforms not really complicated and find a way to reach the tank keeper pyramid tank keeper it was an ancient monitor no, not a tank keeper oh this effect is so cool to teleport to the old side so cool so let's go there so we have completed uh let me check okay i'm going to be confident and boom oh this sounds like an ancient monitor <laughs> yep you were able to hear this so boss room look at this oh in the past i remember that you needed to jump to fall uh, at the left and right sides but now they just added one teleport and you can see that the image it's um uh, it's like frozen it's interesting because maybe they can add this with uh something in something live anyway and let's go there guys we're going to fight one ancient monitor and oh look at this we can get the preview so there are there is one two red one clocky two clockies one pirate robot hey and we have this yellow warnings okay they are waiting for us and the ancient monitor so let's go there guys boom okay let's destroy the turrets because they are always very very okay let's sweep the leg great boom and only missing the ancient monitor elite then elite oh he was waiting oops oh he's so passive he's doing nothing what he's doing nothing okay i'm going to report this because He's so passive right now. He's, okay, I'm going to wait another backstab. Because, let's see if we can... Maybe one attack. One special. One special. One special. Okay, another attack. Maybe if we get in front of him, nothing happens. Okay, we can dance. Can we dance? Okay, how it was? No. Ah, it was... Let's meditate. Ah! Okay, okay, okay. Let's do something. Can I... Okay, okay. Let's, let's do this. Let's do this. Okay, let's do this, guys. Okay, okay. Let's take one screen. No, come on. No, let's let's see if I can do it. Boom! <laughs> I want to do the screenshot. Okay, cool. Let me meditate now, like this. Okay, let's see if we can get this done. Oh man, oh man. Oh, beautiful! <laughs> I knew that I needed to buy this. I, I needed to buy this. This is a mode in the marketplace. Oh my goodness! Okay, let me see. The other one that I bought, it's this one. Sip a cup of coffee. <laughs> okay, let me see. If I do this now, now this, this is not. Okay, let me see if I can do the same again. Drink a cup of coffee in front of the ancient monitor. Okay, let me let me see. I want to get this done. Ooh, this effect. 
So if I did no. Okay. It's oh no. And the cup of coffee is still there. Okay, that's that's an interesting bug to report. So um Okay, let me do this again. See if I have a cup of tea, I guess it is, not a cup of coffee. See. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, so cool, guys. So cool. Let me see. I would love to also uh, create a meme. It's time to do these kind of things now that this is back. So, um, let's do this. No. Okay. Once again. Once again. Let me see. Something like this. Great. I will make one video with the audio and another one without the audio for the gift meme, you know. And also the one for the meditation. Let me see. I want to get this done in front of the engine monitor. I mean, in my in my mind, it's something crazy, something great. But maybe la later it's a stupid thing. But anyway, let me do this in front of this and meditate. <laughs> okay, it's stupidly crazy. So it's this. Okay. Um. If I do this, no. Okay, I need to do this in this way. Great. <laughs> okay, let's finish this. And boom, level up and dungeon completed. And there we go. Tank Keeper defeated and we can open the test. Um, Colonel Shell, nothing interesting. Oh, the okay, these globs, maybe I'm not sure, but anyway, we need to wait for the recap. So let's see these globs. No, so we can mark everything as trash to sell later. And we are, oh, we have skill points. What is the benefit? Um. Okay, the cooldown will reduce, I guess, right? But it's consuming more energy. Mm, no, I prefer this. Cool. And done. So no artifact fragment this time. Up. Oh, wait. That's weird because I remember getting more artifact fragments in the past. Okay. Oh. I remember that always, well, always when I tested previous time. Oh, look at these guys. This is the intro for Times End. That's pretty cool. Look at this. So beautiful. This animation. Look at this. You can see an overall of the city, Water Town. And now it's flying this way and we will and also let me this background music here in the intro it's a new one i guess it's a new one i don't remember exactly but i would say so yeah so cool guys so cool oh and i forgot to use the title because okay but let's go let's go okay something that I forgot it's the new appearance of the titles. You can see that you don't only see the, the title, the, the, the text for the title that you have. Also, the color of the rarity here. You can see that this guy, Horokan, he has a blue dot and that means that it's a rare title. I have uncommon, rare and epic, but no legendary. I have no titles that are legendary but let's keep the one that i love it's it's a, just an uncommon i guess i know it's a rare it's a rare one the lucky knight i 
I won the well, not one. I earned this one when I was playing in the goal pass season one year and a half ago and I've been using most of the time this title because I love it the lucky knight there was some theories that while I was using this title I was able to also win these two legendary weapons and many other NFTs so I don't know if this is true or not but for me it's something very special and I love to use it because thanks to this because when I was using this title I won so many cool NFTs obviously obviously not all of them because many of these epic ones I bought them in the marketplace this is the only one and another shoulder don't remember which one uh, that I won that here playing in the game but most of them I bought them in the marketplace so now I'm not I'm I didn't keep my title so let's do this boom and now we can see here the title and yeah we are not able to see our own title i mean the the rarity dot but all players will see this so guys something cool now well first of all let's activate here the checkpoint well the waypoint it's called the waypoint yeah, i have a video explaining all the different waypoints and where you can find them but now that they changed the, the position the location of some of them maybe i will need to to create a new video for this <laughs> i don't know anyway we found the first waypoint here in watertown pier and there is another one just in front well, just uh, ahead in watertown city and we are going to activate it right now but something cool guys is that we have many optional quests but it's better to do them because you are going to get extra experience and gold and maybe something else but there is a main quest line and then optional quests so many many things guys to do now that's pretty cool and i can say that you can be for many levels you can feel like you are you have a purpose and something to do that's pretty pretty cool so you can see one of the optional quests it's getting the daily and weekly bounties something very important is you can get extra rewards while you are playing and this is what i did loot items that's a pretty pretty, pretty easy to do and complete complete adventures okay great because i need to complete uh how many more i need 13 i need 13 quests and well adventures so hey three more that's easy and kill an enemy with an explosive barrel okay um it's not impossible it's it's a little complicated maybe but let's try to do this and destroy robots 250 okay so um let's do it so let's try to see if we can activate the weapon should be there i guess oh one tambok okay let's see if we can kill it okay level seven Ooh. oh wait, wait 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 these ones are more difficult to deal with okay ah okay so careful okay and we kill the time bug but careful because the little ones they are so annoying and we did it let's play some more music because everything has stopped so let's activate the weapon that should be oh we need to enter that portal there this is for the okay i'm not going to spoil you yet guys because you know that i'm part of the console team um i already tested this and i know what it is but i'm not going to reveal yet hey sigurdsson welcome to the stream man our gameplay looks so much better since the last time i checked oh absolutely i can tell you that the team has worked hardly on this and they 
they implemented great red improvements i can tell you and some dungeons now they are gorgeous seriously they did a great job and the economy is still not here so i mean it's pretty pretty cool and the economy is still pending i don't know if maybe the next patch 28 the economy will be implemented not sure because the, uh, there are no official news i guess oh party invitation that is accepted oh okay another invitation let's go but i need to find a waypoint but ah, it's there it's there but as i was saying uh yeah these pads man if you have the chance well you have a an invitation to play you have the ruby pass right so yeah if i were you i will test this this game this part because it was today is the first day so pretty cool and you are still on time to test it new pocket watch here oh man i have a new pocket watch okay i'm not sure okay i can switch the pocket watch once we are inside um and why let's go there so um okay let me see if i can sell some stuff yeah you will see that now we are not going to get so good prices like before with the green droid uh, doesn't look like that so anyway boom yeah well at least we were able to collect 10k gold let's teleport there we go oh 10 14 seriously okay uh they are entering the portal and so right now you get loot boxes instead of permanent progress well no the loot boxes uh sigurdsson if you mean the one that yuri b was sharing before in the big time channel of meta brands that was a uh, part of the airdrop of the previous month i mean there is an airdrop every month and if you complete at least one adventure and you own at least one nft uh, you are eligible for uh, one of these loot boxes the more nfts and the more adventures you complete up to 20 the more chances to get a better uh, tier of the loot box but yeah that's that's the loot box that Yuri B was sharing before. So probably you mean this. Uh, let me see. Oh, tier two. I need this. Okay, let me see. I mean, I hope that they don't get mad at me for doing this. Switching pocket watch. Let me see. Okay, inventory. Let's do this okay cool so why i'm still level eight whoa oh i see yep ah it's level eight great find the bomb oh now i see maybe it's because it's part of the tutorial and the pocket watch that i got it has at least the same level that I had when I was talking with his Brottinger. That's cool. So, um, let's do this. Oh, much better. Much better. And sweep the leg. Back stop. And not sure what else. Okay, let's go. Let's go, guys. Because I don't want to miss any experience. Let's go there. Okay, because now they are 200 meters away okay let's see you know if nothing changes and you are more than 200 meters away you are not getting experience neither nfts collectibles so oh you can see one of them they have the epic title the laughing knight and a common common title i can see there okay cool and chest piece for the time warrior let's share it and this is an optional quest by the way oh what is this what is this chronomancer so let's share it for the chronomancers 
and the time warrior and these legs for later i mean they are not really special but it's fine boom let's go and this player the one with the epic title yeah hey, resurrection is right okay not needed this one has the epic armor set for the phantom fixer a very cool one i guess that i only have three items of the no only two only two items of the epic armor set i guess let me check quickly one two ah three i have three hey wait i have three okay let's see if i can kill it ah oh, it's an elite it's an elite wow maybe i need to run away okay it's going to take me a little of time so oh someone died someone died let's go there and let's go there and revive oh boom wow oh shit this shadow king what the hell is he doing oh my goodness okay let's go there okay this is turning seriously crazy okay and okay i have the skills in the in different okay let's go there if i had the shurikens oh my goodness okay let's go and oh we have two down okay it's time to go to the resurrection shrine let's go there they are still down okay they are live again so that's the problem when you play for the first time maybe it's a little confusing and chaotic but don't worry this is just at the beginning oh 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 okay i need potions and i have i didn't set the potions in my hot key bar oh my goodness why do i need to do this in this moment no okay uh seven no okay let's go help mana hunter help anyway oh come on I'm there we go obviously the level of these enemies it's far above the mine so makes things very very difficult there we go boom and I'm missing so many items and anyways I will do Come on. Okay, back stop for you. Let's rest. Uh, installing now will be fun to try out. Oh, nice. Let me know when you're playing. Secret Sam, maybe we can play together. Let me collect things. Uh, what about this? Quantum Fixer. Let's share it. Okay. Sword. let's destroy this turret oh come on oh man and potion let's rest let's rest oh 25 seconds they increase the time great okay let's use the back stab with the elite let's see Ah, and he fail. Come on. Ah, oh, no, no, no. I didn't. Okay, let's. 
it. Like a stab? There we go. I mean, it doesn't make sense to use the back stab with an enemy like this, but it's an elite and it's level 11, I guess it was. So yeah, for sure, trade. I can tell you that the update can take a little of time, so be patient. But sooner or later, you will get it. Oh, something important, guys. When you are resting, you get a lot of aggro, so be careful when you decide to rest. Time Warrior, let's share it. Oh, back a step with this one. We failed the super back. And, oh, it's not done yet. Oh, this is from an optional quest. This a scarecrow, I guess, is in English. I don't remember. It's in a scarecrow. Well, it's in a statue, but yeah. <laughs> and oh, come on! No potion and drinking health potions all the time. Enemies nervy. Okay, let's rest a little. Let's see if we don't miss anything. Okay. And someone is activating this. Oh, 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 oh. I don't know if it's really a good idea. Oh, come on. Okay, we need to kill these bugs as part of the quest. We are surrounded. Oh my goodness. Because we have the enemies from before the quest and now the new enemies that spawn wow okay sweep the leg sweep the leg not yet come on and oh level up just in time oh okay i need to get invisible if things get more complicated oh come on no Okay, like now, for example. Oh, before I died, I wanted to get invisible, and I simply died. Doo -doo -doo -doo. And completed the quest, right? Portsmouth arrival in four seconds. Okay, let me use one three of life, just here. Let's share this. Uh, what is this? Uh, okay, let's collect this axe. This time we're... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Encrypted item acquired. You have got your first encrypted item. Oh, okay. This message, it's new. I never saw this before. Oh, no. Okay, uh, this is getting very, very complicated. Let's see. It should lag. Okay. Oh. Why did you start a new mission before we complete the bomb? Yeah, that's also important. If you need to complete the objectives and there is a timer, don't start an optional quest. That's basic. But anyway. Uh. Okay. No problem. I mean, today is the first day. Probably there are too many new players playing big time and enjoying this new patch. So, we all need to learn when we are playing for the first time. So, it's all normal. This happened to all of us in the past.
Okay, so we need to find a new dungeon because uh, do I have something to sell? Ooh, look at the oh level fifteen. So not yet. Hmm, I don't have any belt yes yet. So and this one has evasion. Oh, this is a very good one. Um, I need to decrypt this, but it's level fifteen, so I won't be able to use it. But anyway, and can I use this? Oh, great! So skill trees. Uh, what can I do? I want the shuriken. This shuriken. So, uh, one part. Oh, ninja. So let's go to the town because I want to unlock the shuriken. I mean, the shuriken. It makes a huge difference. When you are fighting with or without the shuriken, so oh man, I won't be able to unlock this. Let's use the teleport. Oh, what is this? Oh man, are we going to fight this? Looks like that. Oh man. Okay, I'm going to spoil you guys. This is part of the Franklin quest line. So I didn't start this quest line yet, so um, I don't know if no, it's not going to count to me. But okay, let's let's go and play and have fun. So um, oh, do we want to enter there? I'm out. Okay. Someone is leaving, I guess. Uh, should we go? Level requirement 12. Oh. Okay, so we have a problem. Level requirement is 12 and... All of us, we are 7, 9, 9, 11. So, no, it's not possible to do this yet for us. Oh, one tambo here. So, um. Doo -doo 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 -doo. I want the shuriken. So, uh, let's sign the dexterity points. Great. Um, I want to save my three skill points for the uh, shuriken. So, passive three. Oh, we can get this. Pocket watch slot. Cool. So, finally. And now we have three slots instead of four, uh, two. Let's go. Cool. So, uh, let me see. They are looking for a new dungeon. So, let's go there. Only 11 need to be 12. Done. And one six, maybe it's too easy for us. So, we need a bigger challenge. And that zone is a bad idea because it's the no man's land, I guess. That's the name. And there the enemies are so powerful. So bad idea. One six again. Hmm. Yeah, I guess that we need to go deeper into the forest. There we will find better dungeons. And in the meanwhile, I'm going to unlock the ninjutsu path. For the shurikens so let's go let's go let's go is that okay oh, oh man it's too far away and uh, meet erwin's associate and speak with your class trainer okay man let's go there okay i have some optional quests Find a shrine that resets the uh, lock weapon. Okay, we have so many things. Let's see if I can unlock this. Well, complete this optional quest, I mean. No. Um, speak and lock. Okay, let me see if I can talk with me. Oh, I'm going to die. Not. <laughs> didn't die, but 
so close. Okay, um, this waypoint did activate it before, yeah, I guess. So, so my class trainer, it's just there. So let's go. It's past the time warp class trainers. So let's go there. Okay, Shadow Blade One. I want the ninjutsu guy. And it should be this one, I guess. Ninjutsu! And finally. So, great. See? Skills? Oh, the shuriken. Boom. The more skill points, more times the shuriken is going to bounce and hit more enemies. That's very important, guys. So, abilities. Um, yeah, this one. Six. Oh, I need to reassign the, the skills. Okay, um... Okay, um... How could I do this? Well, okay, perfect. This looks much better now. Um, something like this. Five. Okay. Looks better. And potions, potions, potions. Anyway, that's fine. Um... So, I don't know if they want to do something else. That was cool. Um, now I have the shurikens. And probably I will need to... Complete leafy passage. Okay, that's a dungeon that I will do by myself. By now, um, let's see if we can play with this group. The problem is that I don't have any po- Oh, look at this. Look at this. The shuriken. Boom. Oh, man. Lacerated. Boom. And this is level 10, 14. This will be a good one. 10. Okay, who was saying this? Mana Hunter. Let's go. And find Mana, Mana Hunter. Oh, a Tangbok. They just killed this Tangbok. Okay, let's go there. Oh. Okay, this Saint has... Ah, Saint! I guess that he's an early access uh, player. His name sounds familiar to me. Okay, so... Uh, Let's go! Let's see if we can level up to 10. Level 10. And... Complete adventures. Oh, I need to open the chest by myself in order to... To count as completed. Okay. And... Okay, ah, and the previous dungeon we failed, so... Yep. Insectoid Nest. Oh, you will see, guys, here you can see a lot of new assets and the new looking for the... for this forest dungeons. Okay, let's start... Oh, the roof generator. Okay, so we are five. Look at this, how many assets, and you will see the different effects. Now, because it's uh, daylight, uh, but this this dungeon with these new assets at night, it's so beautiful. Believe me. So many light effects, and it's so cool. Seriously. So, you know that dungeons, at least the forest, you can see this... Uh, in daytime, also at night, and also during the evening. Well, with the sunset, and wow, so many different effects. Oh, the shuriken! I forgot to use the shuriken. Ah, anyway. Oh, 
This is a trap? What is this? Okay, I forgot to use the shuriken. Just let's see if I can use it now. Oh, this turret. What the? Let's use the shuriken. Oh, but man, we need a, a chronomancer. And we are all time warriors and shadow blades. Oh, 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 oh. There we go. Boom. Wow. So beautiful when you see the platform breaking. So beautiful. Oh, another trap. But now traps are not so intuitive. And this. Oh, wait. Oh, man. Oh, okay. So, uh. Oh, let me think. Okay, now, well, maybe you remember in the previous. Oh, wait. What the hell? Now, traps are. Well, before it was uh, like a circle there and you were able to see the trap easily, but now it's a real challenge. So, let's get closer to the other players so we are not missing any experience. Let's see, uh, we can collect something. Oh, another trap! Uh, what about this? Oh, Shadow Blade test piece! I'm not able to use it yet because level, but for later. And it's an uncommon asset. So, what about this? Oh, Tomb Portal! Cool. I didn't have anything yet. More items, more Tomb Portal. Oh, this is for the Quantum Fixer. And okay, thanks. Ah, uh, the roof generator, and there is only one, I guess. Wow, that's a nice improvement that you don't need to break to destroy three of them. Only one, if that's true. Oh man, this is the best patch of big time ever. Okay, let's use the black and let's use the shuriken and boom. Okay. Oh. oh the shuriken. Come on. Wow. Oh, uh, a belt. Okay, for later. Oh, there are different waves. Okay, let me. Okay, uh, let's see if I can use a tree of life. Okay. Oh, it's a trap or... I don't know. Oh man, so many enemies here. Let me see if I can use the tree of life. Oh, we are surrounded. Okay, looks like there is only one rift generator, but it's more complicated, more difficult than before. Which is, is a good thing. I mean, there are a lot of waves of enemies, but there is only one. That's cool. Let's see if we got something interesting. Uh, Shadow Blade! Finally, some good stuff. And... What else? Okay, we need to go to the boss room, by the way. So time to ah oh, we have mana hunter he's down. Let's see the revive. It's fine. It's just there. So okay, let me go back and try to don't die. Oh man. 
Okay, let me use the speed potion. Because this can take me a lot of time. Otherwise, okay, he's going there? No. So, let's go through this way. Trying to avoid the traps. Wow, so beautiful this, this path. So, um... Man, this dungeon is so huge. We need mounts. <laughs> we need mounts. Okay, there we go. We need mounts in this game in the dungeons. Oh my goodness. When dungeon? I went dungeons. When mounts, right? Okay, there we go. Oops. Rejuvenation. And. No! Man, looks like when you're collecting things or breaking jars or whatever, look like more enemies spawn and try to get you. Okay, there we go. Oh, Mana Hunter, it's none of health. And a lot of re resurrection is right. Let's break all of this. Um, <clears throat> all this turret. What is this? Oh, a trap. It's a trap. What about this guy? Okay. Is anything interesting? Ooh. There we go. And rejuvenation. Oh, you don't have slot for rejuvenation yet. Okay. Yes. Shuriken. Okay. Oh. It's an elite, so oh careful, careful. Okay, let's run away. Like a goer. So uh now we need to go to the boss room, but some Ah, I was able to use the backstab while running. So let me use the health potion. The mineral health potion. Oh, come on. Okay, let's use the sweep the leg. Like this. Shuriken. And... This is an elite, so careful. Let's use the shoe. No, not yet. This one. Some poison because the heart attack. Boom. Let's keep moving. Ow. Something cool is that you find so many, so many... Oh, the enemy. Trees of life uh, here plays in the in the same scenario, same dungeon. That's a pretty cool thing. And they are permanent, obviously. Uh, there we go, the boss room, as I told you. There we go. The boss rooms are now not only with the yellow big door, they are only... Open spaces like this. Okay, let's. Ooh! Back stop. Back stop. And Shuriken. Okay. Ow! Oh, come on! Shuriken. Okay. Maybe they are. Let's see if I can kill this one from behind. Yeah, Shuriken for you. <laughs> Oh, come on. I'm failing the combos. All the... Ah, I was too excited. Careful, Sane. Careful. Hey, okay, thanks, guys. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Careful, careful, careful. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Careful. I'm gonna hand on me. We are down. Careful. No. Eight seconds for me. Oh, level up! I can believe it. Okay, we need to save. Okay, let me go invisible. 
Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, oh, oh. I got you. Uh. Oh. Run, run, baby, run, baby, run, 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 run. Bro, Joe. Man, he... This confuses me a lot because he has a collectibles of a quantum fixer, but he's a time warrior, right? Yeah, I think so. Okay. Oh. No. There we go. Woo. Okay. Oh, an epic, an epic one. <laughs> I'm not able to use it yet, but hey. Okay, let's use the bucket stab with this elite. Boom. I mean, it's so sad to use a bucket stab with a minor back like this. But they are so powerful right now to me. Um, Shadow Blade? No. Hey man, I'm level 10. There we go. Now, now we are together and that's the best thing. Fighting together. for the time warrior let's share it and share it and mission complete so let's collect everything because i can see so many cool things and this is for the time warrior so uh let's share it oops let's share it with error chronomancer let's share it time warrior share and this is for the shadow kicks. Oh, this is for me. Uh, the warrior. Let's share it. Shadow blade. Cool. Oh, an epic shadow blade. Mm -hmm. Like it. Chronomancer. Ah, okay. Let's collect it because maybe I can start a chronomancer later. Then we're all oh, epic. The warrior. Okay, let's share it. Hey. What happened here? Ah, uh, oh, a legendary pocket watch tier 2 for him. Great. So, I'm going to collect... What about this? Nah. Uh, let me collect this. And uh, what about... Oh, the warrior. Uh, Where's this? Quantum fixer. Let's share it. Oh, man. Um, no idea what is this, so I can check it later. Oh, quantum fixer! Okay, let's collect things for Quantum Fixer because maybe we will need this. Okay, and it says shared by someone. Cool. So I'm thinking to start Quantum Fixer. Oh, by the way, let's update the title. 8 of 20. Okay, I would like to complete two more adventures. And I still have time, so more or less 3, 40 something minutes, I could play more. So let's see, um... Okay, so... I didn't complete any quest yet, so... Wow! Ah, oh, I have the bug! Okay, let me see if I can do this here, for example. Uh, because I need this back. I need this back. Okay. Uh, something. Can I do this? Oh, great. Great. So, um. Now, it's interesting, yeah. It was available already in the previous parts that you can place backs in your inventory and play like this. So, no more dangerous actions like dropping the bag to collect it later with your actor so that's that's a great improvement so um 
Can I use any gear or not yet? Yeah. Um. Oh, and here the gears. I'm not able to use gears right now because I switched the pocket watch, I guess. And. Okay. Probably I will drop this later. Let me see. Can I drop this? Definitively. Yeah, this weapon. I don't want this weapon. So, yeah. Let's go here and drop this so I can place the quantum fixer pocket watch just there. Something like this. Oh, I need to destroy it because it's bound to my account. So, something like this, for example. And now I can place the quantum fixer pocket whites. So, I have one more slot available. Great. So, um, where are they? Oh, they are all in water town. <laughs> and now faunas they are not so easy to kill they have more life than before but that's oh a pirate cyber pirate i wonder what level is he let me see 15 19 okay 14 i am 10 okay this is not for me so let's see if we can this is a player right oh they did he's a early access player as well i think so or at least yeah from the jade pass at least i guess or even before i remember oh wait wait the decal it's there Okay, you can see when I'm jumping. Oh, and now disappear. Are you looking for okay, I'm going to report this because it's a little weird. Look, don't touch. If you, break it, you, you could see the the decal when I was jumping and Maybe I can help you with something. and touching the floor, but now Welcome it's gone again. Oh wait, 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 maybe it's the city that there is no decal in the city. Uh, no. It's gone definitively. Okay. No, it's gone. And it's gone. Ah! It's back! What the hell? Okay, now the decal is there. Now it's there. Come on, ah, wait. And it's gone. Mm, now it's here again mm, ah maybe it's the terrain the, the the surface maybe the decal it's just below the surface and that's why we are not able to see it not sure now it's there now it's there now it's there and now it's not there Okay, I will share this with the with the team because it's a little weird. But anyway, I love the the foot step decal uh, visual effect. That's pretty cool. I, I wanted to buy uh, the, the cheapest ones, the coal, and the other one it was the energy uh, foot steps decal and particles. They are very cheap, only two or three dollars for each one i guess but this one for the void particles and the cow i guess uh the particles it was about ten dollars or something like that and the decal was uh 16 dollars more or less but guys I, I just love the effects and for a shadow blade using this uh void uh foot steps it looks so so impressive and yeah, I wasn't confused about this. I wasn't wrong. They looked so nice. So we have one quantum fixer in the party. Oh, that's a great thing. Because we were three time warriors and two shadow blades. And I will love to use my quantum fixer, but... Yeah, 
this party needs something. Oh, four time warriors. Oh, wow. That's a lot. That's a lot of time warriors. Anyway, at this level, it's good. I mean, would be better to have a chronomancer at least when you need to destroy or to kill enemies from the distance, like these uh, turrets that they are above in some kind of platforms there, floating in the sky. There, the chronomancers are very useful. And now we are not fighting yet to those enemies with areas with poison, uh, fire, coal areas, but we are going to find them sooner or later. Maybe at level 14, 15. And if you don't have a chronomancer there, they are so difficult to, to deal with. Eh, 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 turn back. Eh, Torito. Oh, 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 ah! No, come on. Oh, I'm still... Ah, he wanted to fight the... The fauna. Look at this, look at this. Boom. And done. It's important to kill these tank bugs because sometimes they can drop NFPs. I mean, I remember the first day that they implemented enemies here in the open wall. The first day, the very first day. I didn't get any NFT from the tank bug, the first tank bug that we fought. But one of one member of our party, he got a rare NFT. I'm talking obviously from the um I guess it was the Arty Axis. I don't know if it was in the silver or jade spa season, don't remember. But anyway. Is there any PvP or just PvE for now? There is only PvE by now. Uh Sigurdsson only PvE, but they already shared that they have plans for the PvP. I mean, in their roadmap, they always had PvP in mind, but for a very future uh, release, I mean, probably once there is the public release, they had in mind to, to implement the PvP. But I guess that they realize how many other games they implemented PvP, I mean, blockchain games, Web3 games. They implemented PvP and this was so successful that I have the feeling that they uh, increased the priority to implement PvP in this game. So I cannot tell you when this is going to be implemented, the PvP I mean, but I guess that we are going to see the PvP sooner than what we thought at the beginning based on his original roadmap. Obviously, this is not a promise, but I have this feeling. Because uh, once they implement PvP, obviously, I don't know in which way, the game is going to be, wow, incredible. Because, for example, I don't know if you, Sigurdsson, watched me uh, playing Ember Sword when they released the technical demo for some days. Three days, I guess it was. Two or three days. And they implemented PvP in the last, uh, out, well, the last public demo public alpha demo yeah they impl they released the pvp and man i was completing quests crafting equipment and so on in ember sword i'm talking about but pvp was there there were arenas and you were able to fight against uh, players i mean it was an open fight you were able to fight everyone there and everyone was able to fight with you i mean it was all against all something like that and like a death match something like that and it was so so nice i mean it was unfair because uh, i was i was a, a shotgunner and everyone was fighting against me because probably uh, people with guns they are very hated but man magicians they were also so cool and both but i mean the important thing about this is that pvp needs to be implemented very 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 early i guess obviously it's not an easy thing to do but man it's so important to to get this done but yeah they have well there are so many features to implement that obviously uh, it's difficult to do this all at once for me even before the pvp for me i would love to see the the friends list so i can add friends and for example if you uh log in into the game Sigurdsson I can see you you are online and I can invite you easily 
I don't need to go to Water Town and invite you, for example. That will be pretty, pretty cool. And first, the friends list. It's in their plans and sooner or later will be implemented. And also, um, how to say, a search engine or search system, a queue search system so you can find people to play dungeons easily like in world of warcraft and any other mmo rpg so this is something that it's also in their plans and i know that they will try to implement this sooner but obviously this takes a lot of time and work to do so we will see oh Level 13, oh, this is even more difficult than before. Oh man. I mean, yeah, I can fight with them, but with an elite enemy will be difficult to. Oh, and I failed this one. And that sounds so fun. Yep. Honestly, I love big time and I will be playing big time. I can say forever, but I see myself playing big time one more year for sure. I'm all well, I will be playing big time until the public release. Absolutely. Absolutely. Oops, one enemy there. And once the public release it's done. Uh I will keep playing because obviously the economy it's there well probably will the economy will start with the beta i guess not sure uh, what about this i'm collecting everything now oh look at this this chest piece uh let's drop it so we can collect more things but yeah uh oh let's open this chest legendary chest uh, what about this? The warrior. What about this? The warrior. What about this? Okay. Oh! Okay, for my chronomancer. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Careful, it doesn't explode. Not yet, okay. Maybe this will be later. Oh, what is this? Okay, maybe let's use the sweep the leg. Okay, let's take one potion. Yes, for example. And boom. They are still easy because they are just common enemies. They are not elite. Boom. Oh, let me use the backstab. There we go. Wow, even with a common enemy, it's so difficult. And this amulet. Okay, got it. Whoa, you need the potion. There we go. What about this? Nothing. What about this? Ah, I don't know what it is. Oh! And citizen, uh, TV is all okay. I'm not able to read you now, but I will do as soon as I can. So, uh, use backstab. Oh man, that was so dangerous. Okay. Let's rest a little and read. Uh, PV is a lot easier to implement as well. Yep, that's right. So good to get a good working product before adding PVE and game content. Yeah, absolutely. Trying to pick class at this moment is an easy choice for PV. For PvP, I will probably play something more mobile. Yeah, the Shadow Blade, I guess it will be a good one, a good choice for the for the PvP, I guess. Okay, first belt. Okay, let's drop this. 
Okay. And what about this? Oh, this is a good one. Let's drop this. Okay. Uh. Uh. This belt. Let's collect it. And people are fighting, right? What's our legs? Oh, this is a good one. Uh, let's kill some enemies. And I use the bucket stab. So we need to locate the wandering clocky and kill them. So um there are more than one, so yeah. So, let's go. Let's run and oh I was hit by the back. I don't know how but it happened. So uh speed potion Let's run and hit like this And the will win for the Team Warrior be cool Um trying to keep class Yeah Ah more mate Oh, I, I I love the mage, but I never use it because sometimes can turn a little complicated. Oh, that was a trap. Uh, yeah, I remember in World of Warcraft, people who were able to use the warlock or the or the mage, they were impressive. I don't know. I oh, I will. I like it to use the in World Warcraft the rope. That well, the shell blade will be something similar. Pretty similar, yeah. Okay. Ah, uh, someone died. Let's revive. Oh, because the traps. They are dying because the traps. Yeah. Okay. That was something I expected. Okay. Let's keep leveling up the. Shuriken. Let's go. And this is focus your uh, intenting yourself to leave behind void bombs. Okay. Void bombs. This is why I bought oh shit off oh, these traps man. These traps are turning me crazy. Okay, let me see if I can use this shuriken here. Oh, there we go. A rare lex. Great. And I'm level 10, yeah. Wow, enemies. Go, whoa, fly away. Oh, and these are elites, so careful. Ah, uh, I have the, the aggro with this one. And I failed this one. Great. There we go. And I still have the aggro. Awesome. Maybe I... Let's see. Yeah, I lost the aggro. So let's see if I can use the... Oh, I still have the arrow. Come on. What, what do I need to do to get to lose to the focus? Well, there are some gems that you can craft and then you can lose the arrow. That's right. Huh. So maybe that's something that I can try to craft. And also, I should try to get more, well, be more serious on crafting gems because they can be really useful. And in the previous fight, I, I guess that I didn't craft any kind of uh, inventory is full. Okay, I was collecting too many things. Man. Okay, let's use one rejuvenation potion. What is this? 
Chronomancer. Okay. Too many things here. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Blue pants. This is what I wanted. Oh, man. Oh, man. Shadow Blade, right? Shadow Blade. Wow. I mean, I know. It's a tier 2 only. But, man, it's so... So nice to have. Do, do, do. And let's rest a little. I have too many trash things here. Uh, what about this? Mitigation? Okay, that, this is much better. So, let's get this. Oof. What else? I have too many... Too many things that I'm not going to need right now. Don't worry, I don't know why I collected this. Answer. Not now. Not now. So I can drop this and someone is attacking me. Oh. Oh. Oh, I was failing these attacks. I'm not sure if I was too far away, but I'm going to report this. So let's keep moving. So many ah, quantum pixels. Wow! What a party! There we go. Uh, this is for the Time Warrior. Let's share it. The warrior. Nah. This is Chunk. And this. Let's keep moving. One, two, right there. Let's kill it to open the chest. And there is another one just there. Okay. Let's fire the shuriken. As I told you, here a chronomancer will be so helpful. But anyway, I have the shuriken and the time warrior has... Yeah. Hey, we poisoned! Nice! We did it! Let's open the chest. And blue daggers? Oh, I need this. I need this. I need to decrypt this. Wow! A rare tier 2 dagger. That's a great thing. Oh, let's use backstab. Let's use backstab and boom. Okay. Um, we still need to kill the clocks, man. That's taking a lot of time. Um, what about this? Is green and something maybe an optional crash? Wow, let me choose one rejuvenation potion. There we go. One back stop. Oh. Ah. Anyway. And there is a trio for. Oh, let's kill this one. Oh, one mega clocky. Oh, shit. It's a mega clock. Yeah, I don't know. I was using the invisibility because I'm always using number one for the rest. And level up. Okay, cool. So, we need to kill this Mega Clocky, and this is going to be a hard task, I guess. And I have skill point. Another one for Shuriken. There we go. And two more dexterity. There we go. Oh. Let's check this. Oh, I can use this. I can use this. Wait. Okay, not bad. 
Uh, let's go. What about this? Okay, uh, much better. They are fighting the mega clock. Come on! Uh, what about this? Uh... Okay, they did it. Okay, let's share this. <laughs> I didn't participate. <laughs> anyway. Next time. And we have another mega clocky here. So... Let's go. Uh, let's kill this one on the top of the platform. Um... Okay. Let's kill this one. And I miss. I don't know how, but I miss the attack. Let's do it. And boom. Great. Yeah, we could say that right now I'm some kind of chronomancer. So, um. Let's do one back. Oh, come on. Oh. And boom. And the mega clock is there. One of them. And no idea where is the other one. So let's. Oh, I told you. Look at these mushrooms. How beautiful it looks like. Oh. And now you can see this dungeon. It's, it's at night. And you can see all the lightning effects. And they are like flashing so beautiful so let's go there also these are stone these runes this is something new pretty cool let's try to kill this butterfly oh i don't know why i got the aggro let's go invisible and back stop and done we can for you. Oh, it was going to fall. Mom. Oh, I failed the shrieking. I don't know why, but I failed. Boom. And boom. Done. Quantum fixer. Yeah, I guess that I'm going to collect the. This is for the Chronomancer. We don't have a Chronomancer, but anyway. I don't want to start collecting things for pocket watches that I'm not going to use immediately. And... Oh, come on. Yeah, turrets don't explode yet. Probably will be in uh, an advanced dungeons, uh, maybe. There we go. Ah, there is the other one. Okay. Let's see if I can use the buckets. Oh, he already completed. Okay. They are level 15. Okay, 15 and 13, yeah. It's probably an easy thing for them. Let's break these charts and locate the wandering clocky. So we need to find it here. Yeah. So, um. Yeah, we need to find it. Oh, careful with the trap. Uh, okay, let's see if I can use the meditation here. Josep meditates in a moment of tranquility and inner peace. Yeah. 
That's the cool thing about the mold uh, NFTs, collectibles, that you can also, I mean, it's not just an animation, you can also share a message in the chat. And that's a cool thing. That's a cool thing. Oh, come on. Okay, so let's press a little. And let's. The other NFT was this one. And let's see the message. Ah, takes a sip of coffee and feels the returning of their body. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Some enemies here. So yeah, it was a cup of coffee. I I wasn't sure if it was coffee or tea. But yeah. Oh, I love coffee. So it's fine for me. Um mm, mm, How many slots do you have? Three. Let's take it. I mean sometimes I like to play also with a two two hand weapon. I mean, this is not how the Shadow Blade was thought about, but at these levels, sometimes it's also helpful. Obviously, it's up to you and the way, the style of combat that you want to, to, to adopt. Well, back stab and done. And let's keep moving. <laughs> Oops, another enemy. I the little one. It's incredible that even if you kill all the enemies, more new enemies keep spawning. That's, that's, that's a cool thing because uh, when you think that everything is clean and empty, Suddenly, uh, you have more enemies and new surprises. So, would be incredible if also tank bugs and minacokis could spawn as well. Let's spawn and I uh, revive. I mean, and there we go. Let's see if we can find the last minacoki. Well, I guess it's a mega. Oh, careful. Well, something cool about the Shell Blade is that as a Shell Blade you can run really, really fast. So you can avoid these kind of traps easily. What about this? Oh, here there's an optional quest. Maybe it could be there. No, I don't think so. Potion, potion. Now I want to take all the potions that we find. Just up. Oh. Something is. Oh, he found the, the other. The other mega party. Okay. Oh. Be careful. It's curious that when you find the other target, there is a sound. That's that's nice. Okay, let's use the. I oh, I didn't use it. We failed. Okay. Oh, careful! Ah, okay, it was down. Nice. Oh, and there is a time bug as well. Wow. And we need to go to the boss room. So, oh. Be careful. Ah, it's already done. The done book. Is in.
And when and come on axe. What is this? Uh make oh. oh Okay. Uh super black, let's go. interesting here the tribe careful and we need to go to the boss room and oh there is a chest here an epic chest epic chest uh shield that i'm going to share and what about this dexterity base magical okay this is not for me okay i'm going to take this uh less level but more interesting because I'm getting extra dexterity. So we'll share this. Oh, what about this? Strength. Oh, this is for the time warrior. So not the uh, try. Let's keep moving. Hmm. And it's pretty close. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, more enemies. Go this way. Um And oh, I'm level 11 already. Uh, what about these legs? Oh, dodge. Hmm, not so bad. I mean, okay, I'm going to take them. And oh. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, let's go invisible because this is not looking good. And let me see if I can use a tree of life. There we go. And let's use this. One potion and another potion. There we go. Let's use one back stop. And done. Oh, epic something. Epic flex. Let's do this first. Quick fixer. Uh -uh. Oh, these structures so beautiful no idea what they are they look so good okay so at the star oh 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 two time box three okay okay let's use the backstab the big one let's kill the oh, come on Oof. Okay. Okay. Back stop. Almost ready. Okay. Everyone else wants to use the back stop, but no one. Man, when you're surrounded with all of these enemies, even they are not elite. It turns a little complicated. But well, that's part of the talent. Wow. Okay, let's try to use the back stab with Ezo, for example. Oh, 
Oh, this helmet. It's better. It's better. Even it's it's just a common item. Oh, look at this. Let's wait. Let's wait. Wait for it. And three, two, one. No, wait. Wait. Ah. Boom. <laughs> and we did it. Yeah, we did it. Another adventure completed. I need one more for the daily quest. Um, hey, this is maximally damage. Christian could be an interesting one. Let's share it. Shadow Blade Globs. Oh, this is a good one. Let's share this. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Quantum Pixel. Oh, a ring. A ah, ring that's interesting. Um, okay, let me let me empty my pockets. Ah, uh, what could be it? A chromancer. Uh, okay, chromance. Okay, do need. Oh, okay, no. Good feet. No one got an artifact right now. I need to drop something else. For example, this. Yeah, let's drop this. I want this and this. Uh, okay. Let's go to what? Oh, potions. Oops. Okay, let's go to Watertown with this. And in the meanwhile, update the title of the stream. Uh, 9 of 20. Okay. Let's do one more adventure for today. And, wow, three hours playing the, the game. So let's first of all equip the ring. Because I'm interested on this. Specific. Oh. And also this weapon. It's level 17. 11. Oh. Okay. Let's decrypt this. Okay. I need one, four more levels. And it's much better. Yeah. Well, strength. Anyway. And what about this? Oh, four more levels. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to use this. Perfect. Um, what about this? Intelligence. Oh man, I'm not able to use this. Sad. And this is better. Okay. Are you looking for something specific? Um. Oh, another thing that I'm not able to use. And this, hmm, not bad. These stats, not bad. Maybe I can help you with so, something. Okay, should be good enough. What are you looking for? Oof. Mm -mm, no, it's much better the one that I have. What about this? No. What do you need? this uh, so let's nice sell day. some stuff oh looks like people uh, well, people are leaving so I wonder I don't know if they will continue but sell more them. yeah let's sell them and get some free space well okay another thing that what I want need? yeah let's move down the items that I want to keep with me something. There we go. And what about this? Okay, yeah. This is for later. And I need... Oh, intelligence now. Okay. Let's sell it. What else? This oh, quantum fixer. And nothing special. So, let's sell it. Uh, shadow blade. 
Shadow Kicks. Ah, this is a new skill, I guess. Uh, nothing special with this one. Let's sell it. And no idea about these ones. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's try and decrypt them. Oh, two guy. This name sounds familiar. Oh, they are cheap. Oof, uh, okay. Wow. Okay, let's... Why not? Let's... Oof. Uh, what level is this? 15... 20. Okay, let's do it. Why not? Okay, I'm not able to use anything there. And what about this? Intelligence again? Oh my goodness. Um, Chronomancer. And strength. Nothing. Oh. This could be interesting. To deal more damage. So yeah, I will keep this with me. And this for the Shadow Blade? Yeah, oh, okay, I can sell. Can I stack more? No. Okay, so... I I spent some money, yeah. Some gold, but let's recover a little. Okay, I only lost like 2k, something like that. Okay, not a uh, big deal. So... Okay, we have a full party again! Okay guys, so I'm going to try... Let's... Sip a cup of coffee... <laughs> and get ready... To complete one more dungeon... One more adventure, and will be cool the loot items daily quest, but I don't think that I will be able to complete it. But anyway, maybe I can help you with something. Look with your eyes, not with your hands. And let me see. Do I have more skill points? What about this? Oh, look at this! Path of pockets. Hmm, but these ones will be probably very expensive. So, uh, what about this? Next time is away and deal this small amount of them. Okay, I need this to get all of this. When you are the man, you give your party members a ball. Okay, that's an interesting one. Heal all those snarby. Yeah, heal friend. Okay, that's a cool one. When you're uh, you spend with invisibility. Okay, that's very interesting. And okay. Let's see where the other guys are. Okay, so finding a new dungeon. So um Explosive Kunai. Oops. There we go. Uh, oops, someone is fighting the real Elon Musk. I I remember this guy from previous parts. Okay. Ba -da -ba -ba. So guys, this will be probably my last adventure for today. Three, well, more than three hours playing. It's not so bad. I mean, I'm not streaming too much lately, I know. One, two, maximum three times per week, maximum. And sometimes when I'm playing the sandbox, I only play one hour and a half, two hours maximum. But hey, I was very excited to play this part here with all of you guys here in, in Twitch and man this part it's more even from what I was expecting 
really great so let's just start gather exact flora for botanical research okay that's an easy one i guess that this is the one that you need to to harvest and there is a progression bar it's not instantly collected and maybe i was confused at the beginning of the stream by the way when i was saying that there was a, a flora quest that you needed to, to harvest probably is this one let's try to okay not exploring this turret or will be in later levels <laughs> and we have one one quantum fixer finally yeah guys probably i will level up i mean this patch the 27 i don't know how much time we will be playing with this patch but maybe it will be a good idea to get a quantum fixer for mages like Sigurdsson and other players from meta brands that they want to join will be easier if i am a quantum fixer and i can help you guys leveling up and let's destroy that turret Oh, that would be easy, easy, easy. Okay, not get one more, one last time. And done. Okay, let's go. And I can see now more people with NFTs. You can see that for Elvis. He has the uncommon set for the Shadow Blade. I also have this one. I mean, I have the full set for the uncommon armor of the Shadow Blade. You can see him. I have the full set, but for the rare one, the only thing that I'm missing are the gloves. But also the, the uncommon one, it's pretty cool as well. And it was the first one that I got completed. So yeah, pretty cool. And let's keep moving. Oh, wait. No, I wanted this. Ah, okay, I got it. Nice. I thought that... I wouldn't get the, the buff because it was too far away. Yeah, okay. We are two shadow blades. So, uh, well, you can see Dead for Elvis. Oh, look at this, look at this. That's interesting. This is what I wanted. This is what I wanted. Look at this. Look at this. And let's switch. And let's use one of these nfts hammer <laughs> yeah i i prefer the the axe to be honest right now i prefer the axe it's more visible <laughs> i mean if i need to show something it's better to show the Yikes. Okay, let's keep moving. And they are down? Okay, they went. Mm -hmm. Let's let's choose the safe way. Cool. Hello, Blah! And... Okay. Oh. Cool. 
Oh, come on. Yeah, Dorette was dancing. That's always a weird thing to say. And one more shuriken. Boom. Oops. Okay, yeah, stuff for the chronomancer. And by the way, Sigurdsson, are you already playing, or are you waiting maybe for uh, for later when you have more more time? Okay, let's kill this turret. Oh. There we go. Oh, 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 oh. And boom. Done. And let's see if we can open this chest. No, enemies nearby. Oh. This is the reason why. Ah, oh, okay. Now, now. We can open this. And. Oh, there are so many good. Items. I mean, I'm not going to complain about this, but I'm surprised that I can see a lot of good items. At least, yes, just about to hit five. Oh man, amazing! I'm going to leave now, but man, next time let's play together if you want, because that will be pretty cool. And I can, I can, for example, choose the um, quantum fixer to help. I can say that now it's very addicting this. So and um, by the way, which class did you choose? Surprise me, which class? Oh careful, one trap there. And this flora oops. Oh he has one NFT but he's not able to use it now. And we need to go to the boss room. Cool. Oops! Legendary! Man! Ah! Okay, I'm going to report this because the waterfall doesn't let you see this one. Man, that's. Ah! That will be so sad to. To me is one legendary because something like the waterfall was uh well you let you see it okay let's go let's go away because this is an elite and it could take me a little of time <laughs> oh, that was done. Great. Smashing. So cool. Hmm. Uh, wait. Okay, the chronomancer. If that was your okay, mate. And how it is for you? Do you feel it's yeah, it's a uh, it's hard to play as a chronomancer a solo well playing solo right now? I mean do you need help? Because I can I can be with you, for example, if you want to level up a little more. Man, what's happening with this? Because I know that the problem of the Chronomancer is that it's too weak and maybe you can suffer a little if you try to, to go solo. Uh, let's share it with the good one. Not for me. Let's... Oh, 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 oh. 
Okay, let's let's use this. Uh, seems easy for now. You don't lose health yet. Oh, okay, man. Okay. That's cool. Yeah. He was killing me. Nice. Let's keep moving. Lord Moku. Hmm. This name also sounds familiar to me from previous uh, patches. Oops. One trap there. And by the way, I'm level 12. I didn't realize until now. If you need help, Sigurdsson, just let me know. And I can try to help you. Okay, let's go. We need to go to the boss room and we are six. That's a pretty good number. Oh, this guy. Um, Bro, Joe, he has also the hammer of Sir Brunner. Wow, man. But the, the axe, the battle axe, it's so huge and pretty cool. I always love to use it. Oh, I have the ninja leap. Man, I never, I forgot to use it. Oops. Oh, wait, wait, wait. This bomb. Before. And here we have the boss, well, boss room, boss area. So one more. Where's the last one? Okay. The real L mask. Okay, um, we'll do, Brave Man. Yeah, at the end, my idea was that all people, all members from Metabrands that wanted to join big time, my idea was to help them and play together with them. And try to uh, assist and help with the first levels because maybe at the beginning it's a little chaotic or you don't know really how it works. So in the boys channel, I wanted to help and try to explain how big thing works because I've been playing for more than one year and a half. I started in April of the past year and I've been playing. Well, I had a break of four months to be honest, but since. After the break, I've been playing always, so yeah, I mean, I'm not the master knowledge of everything, but I can explain many, many things. And if I don't have the answers, I can try to find them for you. So let's kill this little one with the backstab and boom. These bongos are so cool. They were introduced in the 25 0.25 fight, if I'm not wrong. And they were a great addition. Boom. And we are missing only one more target. So let's go there. Well, we can kill these ones just for some extra XP. <laughs> oh. Okay, we did it. So what about this? Then what? Sheriff. Sharing is scaring. So let's go and open the chest. And daily bounty collect. Wow, so many rewards. Woohoo! Uh let's see him. Let's collect this. Some epic legs. Oh, uh, what about this? Time Warrior. Let's share it. These potions. I need potions. And this is for the Time Warrior, obviously. I mean, this is skin it. Chronomancer. Share it. Time Warrior. Share it. Potions for me. Well, a lot of rewards, but nothing interesting for me at the end. Anyway. Um. 
that's nice will be fun to get them all in here yeah absolutely will be nice i mean i have a lot of uh, spaces and my idea was to help the guild well the guild meta brands as a guild uh try to help the guild to to let's use these spaces in some way i don't know exactly how we'll work the economy we don't have these details yet but yeah my idea was to let use these spaces freely but we will see i play black desert online and used to play wolf so should be okay here oh yeah absolutely if you play uh world warcraft well will be pretty easy i mean you are you are used to to play this kind of games so that's that's nice uh, uh let me exit this dyson like this and um, but you said something about having an nft when do I, where do i buy that oh yeah uh you can buy that in the marketplace and i'm going to give you uh, a code that you can use you can use my name basically Giuseppe. oh it's in cattle you can use this this code because if you do so i don't i'm going to get some benefits but i'm not sure about what i don't know if it's money or loot boxes or i'm not exa exactly sure because i never shared my code before and my idea because i'm a, an ambassador of big time and i get this kind of benefits but anyway if you want to use my code i will appreciate you a lot but yeah you can go to the marketplace of big time and let me find it for you is it open loot open loot is the website for the marketplace and there you need to go to the marketplace filter for big time and sort low to high the price if you only want to buy a very cheap nft so there we go this is the link and here you have all the filters to get the cheapest nft with only one dollar uh you you can buy emotes uh yeah collectibles like armors weapons i guess many many things for only one dollar pretty cheap so i'm going to leave and saying goodbye to the party and let's use the meditation let's see if they can see this in the chat <laughs> oh that's a cool emote to use when you are leaving a party to just meditate at the end oh and okay that that's cool so let's go because for tomorrow i want to leave my character in Waterton. so well i don't know if i'm going to yeah i need to play tomorrow because uh let me update the title let me update the title 10 of 20 adventures completed for the airdrop of august so i need to play 10 more adventures and honestly i don't know if i will be able to do so but at least i guess that tomorrow i should be able to play five adventures five and 15 of 20 it's not a bad number so yeah still a, a good one i mean there are four tiers to get uh, the loot boxes from the airdrop four tiers and the best tier as possible is the grand uh loot box it's a black box that you can find for 60 something dollars in the marketplace and i got this one every airdrop even the previous one i completed only 10 adventures but thanks to the nfts that i have in my account i was able to get this uh tier tier one tier one let's say loot box so yeah 
let's see if by completing 15 i can get again the tier one loot box so let's exit the game let's exit the game and there we go uh pa -pa 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 -pa. just chatting and oh sigur send you say something oh just any nft that's perfect yeah you can buy uh any nft that you want any of them will be fine it can be an emote can be uh, let me check for example let me check the the marketplace because you can find titles yeah title is the text in front uh, that can go uh at the uh, at the top of your head with this uh dot color depending the rarity of the title uh emotes uh yeah footsteps decals and particles but these are more expensive well more expensive two three dollars the minimum one uh what else you can find yeah for one dollar you can get only emotes and titles but for some cents more one dollar and five cents you can get also weapons decorations for your spaces what else mm, the equipment the armor i guess it's more exp a little more expensive it's nine or six dollars let me let me filter by the way you can filter at the left side you can find there the categories okay first of all you will find the games because in open loot there are more games not only big time and you can find categories and there you can filter for example for armor and we can see that the minimum price it's six dollars six dollars for the shoulders of the well i don't know why i'm not showing <laughs> okay but anyway i'm not going to show the browser because i don't know if i'm going to show something inappropriate but yeah the thing is that oh the tv just turned off at some point come on anyway yeah you can find the shoulders for six dollars then shoulders of the of the shadow blade six dollars and shoulders of the chromancer nine dollars so yeah the tv is already playing again so yeah it depends on what you want but yeah probably emotes titles and weapons are the cheapest ones so also you only need one nft to participate in the airdrop but you need to also understand that the more nfts you have the more chances i mean every adventure that you complete up to 20 it's like a multiplier for the nfts that you have um, and you are going to get what they call airdrop points I will share later uh, Sigurdsson in the Meta Brands Discord in the channel of Big Time. I will share all of this uh, theory, okay, uh, all the concepts I mean, so you can read carefully. Because um, the adventures that you complete, I mean, you you need at least one, but every new adventure is a multiplayer. And if you have, for example, only one NFT, will be, for example, twenty adventures complete multiplied. To one nft that you have if you have 10 will be 10 multiplied by 20 adventures and so on so it depends on the number of nfts that you have i have i guess that more than 400 and this is why when even i only complete 10 adventures uh let's say it's multiplying 10 adventures for uh well 10 adventures multiplied by uh 400 nfts so i don't know exactly how these points work they never explain exactly so we don't know ex uh, let's say the the formula about this but in a plain mode we could say that i could get like 4k airdrop points so this is why i'm always getting the yeah 400 yeah i know it's it's a lot but it doesn't uh think that i've been playing big time since they won and i got a lot of them uh for free i mean i needed to pay the the gold pass one ethereum <laughs> yeah but all also later i was buying nfts in the marketplace because i wanted to complete many collections as possible so yeah i i, I wanted to collect as many nfts uh, from different varieties 
different classes, different looks. So this is why I have so many. Of course, I have some of them repeated. So that's that's true. But anyway, um, yeah, that's I love I love big time, and I could be maybe one week, one month not playing big time, but at the end I love this game since they won, and every new patch we can see new and great content. So and a lot of improvements. And now that I'm part of the console team, I can see how the team works and I can, well, I don't, I can, I can, I can't share anything about this, but I, I'm pretty confident and I love how they do things. So that's all we can, what can I say? Um, spaces will also be a cool update. Any plan for meta brands? Oh, yeah, uh, for meta brands, all the spaces that I have, I need to understand better how the economy will work and if I will be able to rent, well, I will be able to rent uh, spaces, but my idea was to use, not sure yet if all of them, because I will like to also get some kind of profits renting my spaces, but I have a lot of them and my idea was to share or or provide to the MetaRans members from our guild. I would love to, to share most of my spaces to you guys so you can use them freely to craft things, to also collect tokens, uh, time tokens with the time wardens and things like that because I have also not only spaces but I have also forges, armories, time wardens. So I mean right now i will be the only provider of spaces and all of these interesting items for you guys but even i'm the only one at this moment i guess that we we will have a very cool stuff to use so yep i mean we again we need to understand better how this will work exactly the economy i mean but i will try to get you cover and also because Right now, Sigurdsson, you, we could say you are the most active player from the meta brands. Also, Yurin B, he was very active. Uh, you and Yurin B, you will be benefit out of this. And you will be the only two players that you will be using these uh, spaces and armories and so on. So, looking forward to it. Obviously, man, obviously. So, the idea was to, to create this guild and try to benefit you all, guys. So... Obviously, we need to talk first how this will work, but yeah, I don't know if maybe depending on the relics that you have, you have more access or less, or maybe it, this is independent and you can use whatever you want, up to you. So, but yeah, whatever it is, uh, will be to all of you guys. So yeah, at the end, this is the idea to join the game and have fun and play together. And if it's possible, get profits. So that, that will be great. So... That's all for today. Thank you so much, Sigurdsson, and everyone here in the stream. Thank you so much for watching together and playing together big time today. Today was the first day of the new patch 0 0.27. And guys, I love it. I love it. Because the team were uh, implementing some fixes, bug fixes at the last minute. And now the game works pretty well. Yeah, there are some bugs yet, but it's pretty, pretty cool. So, uh, play to earn aspect will be cool. Oh, absolutely. But the most important is that, in theory, they want to implement some different aspect of the play to earn. So, we will see how this will work. I'm very excited. Hoping for sandbox season 2 soon. Oh, yeah. The alpha season 4 or maybe beta season 1. <laughs> I have no idea what is going to come first. I mean, I don't know what is the next one. Because if you saw uh, Sigurdsson something about uh, an alpha season 4, that's a scam because uh, Sandbox never share anything yet officially about the new season, alpha or beta season, nothing yet. So whatever it is, it's a scam. But yeah, man, I'm so excited as well. I'm playing these little experiences just for fun and to collect some sand tokens from the full rewards because I'm minting the avatars. Always I'm minting. Uh, I just miss one or two avatars, but I'm, for, for example, the last one, it's this, uh, how, how it's called? This avatar that can turn 
uh, in a different one every six hours i was minting only one but pretty cool yes looking forward to the mobile release oh yeah man that will be so cool to play from mobile will bring so much more players oh absolutely and also because sandbox uh probably you know this but sandbox they created well the original game of sandbox it was a mobile game for ios and android and it had a lot of success millions of players so just imagine if they connect in some way the let's say the original web 2 game of the sandbox with the web 3 game in some way maybe just a link to the app store or whatever but that will be huge huge seriously so i can wait for this lands are so cheap now had to buy a buy <laughs> okay great man yeah i still have my lands from uh the pre the pre-sale number two yeah i bought uh 12 by then and they were pretty cheap only 40 dollars but even it was only 40 dollars the amount of ethereum it was a high one so uh la, 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 had to yeah we'll be sick yeah absolutely we'll be sick man so can't wait for this and tomorrow i will be playing big time but i need to play uh, the sandbox uh sooner as well so we'll see we'll see so thank you so much Sigurdsson. thank you so much everyone uh yeah <laughs> so hope to see you soon and hope that you also enjoy the stream of today and if you have any comment feedback whatever feel free to share it always here in the chat in the metaverse discord or wherever you want obviously i will be uploading this stream to my youtube channel so you can watch it later so if you want to see something specific whatever if not see you next time you too seriously bye bye enjoy your the rest of the day or have a good day well for you it's enjoy your the rest of the day and have a good night for the rest of you guys depending where you are bye bye Hey, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to tap on the thumbs up button, subscribe to my channel and turn on the bell to stay tuned for more videos. See you next time!